This country consistently ranks as one of the happiest countries in the world. Hello, welcome to Open Tierra. Today, we're exploring Sweden, a Scandinavian gem known for its stunning landscapes, vibrant cities, and rich cultural heritage. Stay tuned to discover more about Sweden's history, food, and unique contributions to global culture. Sweden is located in Northern Europe on the Scandinavian peninsula. It borders Norway to the west, Finland to the northeast, and is connected to Denmark in the southwest by a bridge. Sweden has a long coastline along the Baltic Sea and Gulf of Bothnia. The landscape varies across the country, with dense forests and mountains in the north and flatter plains in the south. Its climate is temperate but varies by region. It can be divided into three major land regions. Northern Sweden is mountainous and heavily forested. The Scandinavian mountains run along Sweden's western border with Norway. Central Sweden has a mixture of farmland, lakes and forests. Southern Sweden consists of plains and rolling hills with agricultural land. About 15% of its land area is agricultural. Sweden has an extensive coastline along the Baltic Sea and Gulf of Bothnia in the east. The coast has many inlets, islands and peninsulas. The three largest islands are Gotland, Uland and Orust. Stockholm, Sweden's capital and largest city, is located along the central east coast. Other major coastal cities include Gothenburg and Malmö. The population of Sweden is estimated to be over 10 million people. It has become an increasingly diverse society, with immigrants making up over 20% of the population today. Though relatively ethnically homogeneous in the past, immigration has transformed Sweden into a multicultural nation. Historically, Swedes were a Germanic ethnic group. Today, over 80% of the population is ethnically Swedish. Other large ethnic minority groups include Finns, Iraqis, Syrians and Poles. Indigenous Sami people live in northern Sweden and have their own language and culture. Sweden also has a small Roma community. Swedish is the predominant language spoken in Sweden. It is part of the North Germanic language group. Several minority languages are also spoken, including Finnish, Sami languages and Romani. Most Swedes also speak excellent English as a second language. The majority of Swedes are Lutheran Christians, with over 60% belonging to the Church of Sweden. However, religious observance is relatively low. Other religions practiced include Roman Catholicism, Eastern Orthodoxy, Islam, Judaism and Buddhism. Over 30% of Swedes are non-religious. Swedish cuisine is known for its simple everyday comfort foods featuring local ingredients. Though the flavors are often subtle, several dishes have become beloved icons of Swedish cooking. The kanelbulla is a sweet, ubiquitous Swedish cinnamon bun topped with pearl sugar. This tasty baked good is a go-to fika snack with coffee. Filmsjölk is a uniquely Swedish cultured milk product similar to liquid yogurt. With a sour yet mild flavor, Filmsjölk is often enjoyed with breakfast or fruits. Toast Skagen features shrimp salad served open-faced on toast. This colorful, rich seafood appetizer originates from Sweden's west coast. Sweden has a long, fascinating history spanning from the Stone Age to its rise as a modern nation. Strategically located along important trade routes, Sweden was influenced by many European powers throughout its development. The early history of Sweden begins with the Stone Age, around 12,000 BC, when hunter-gatherers first inhabited the region. The Bronze Age brought trade and advancement to Scandinavia. During the 6th century AD, clans and chieftaindoms emerged, establishing themselves as kings over territories that would eventually become Sweden. 
From 800 to 1050 AD, Swedes were active as Vikings, raiding and trading along European coasts and rivers. The Vikings brought Swedish influence to parts of Europe, even settling in lands as far as Russia. As Vikings converted to Christianity, a unified Swedish kingdom began to take shape. By the 12th century, Swedish kings had consolidated power across the lands that now make up Sweden. Trade increased within the Baltic region. In 1397, the Kalmar Union joined Sweden with neighbours Norway and Denmark under one crown. Sweden eventually rebelled against Danish rule in 1523, beginning the early modern period. The country rose to prominence as a European great power in the 17th and 18th centuries, with territories around the Baltic Sea and beyond. King Gustavus Adolphus and others expanded Sweden's military might. Science, art and culture flourished during this enlightened era. Eventually, costly wars led to the dissolution of the Swedish Empire. The country remained neutral in both world wars. After World War II, the Social Democrats shaped modern Sweden with progressive reforms, a strong welfare system, environmentalism, feminism and globalism. It joined the EU in 1995 but kept its currency. Sweden has a developed, export-oriented economy that relies heavily on trade. Its GDP is around $591 billion, according to World Bank data. It has a skilled labour force, ample natural resources, and a productive and high-tech manufacturing sector. The Swedish economy is primarily focused on services, communications, information technology, and trade. Sweden's early economy was based on agriculture. In the 19th and 20th centuries, Sweden rapidly industrialized with mining, steel, machinery, chemicals and textile industries. After World War II, Sweden shifted to a modern welfare state with government reforms promoting private business. Today, Sweden champions innovation, sustainability and competition. Major industries and exports include automobiles, machinery, forestry products, iron, steel, and telecommunications equipment. High-tech and pharmaceutical industries are also growing. Services like banking, retail, and transportation are major components of the economy. Tourism is important, especially to scenic areas. Sweden promotes free trade and has low barriers to international commerce. It features high taxes that support social welfare programs and regulations that protect workers. Privatization has increased competition. While remaining outside the Eurozone, Sweden's economic policies align closely with the EU. It has one of the highest standards of living in the world and ranks highly on economic competitiveness and per capita income. Healthcare, education, infrastructure, economic equality and human development are world class. Poverty is low, although income inequality has risen. Sweden has become a dominant force in shaping pop music over the past few decades. The country has emerged as a pop music mecca due to its development of world-renowned producers and songwriters. Swedish studios have crafted a formula for pop success, combining impeccable melody writing, layered production and American music styling. Swedish writer-producers are highly skilled in appealing to global pop tastes. The Chiron Studios has produced hit songs for world-famous artists such as Backstreet Boys, Boyzone, Robin, NSYNC, Britney Spears and Westlife. Producer Max Martin epitomizes Sweden's pop dominance. He has written over 20 Billboard number no. 1 hits for stars like Britney Spears, Katy Perry and Taylor Swift. His Stockholm studio has launched the careers of other top Swedish producers. Even as classic Swedish studios have closed, the Sweden sound remains dominant in pop.
New Swedish talents like Tove Lowe and Zara Larsson work with established Swedish hitmakers. Swedish writers and producers are behind many current top 40 hits. The most popular sports in Sweden include football or soccer, ice hockey, handball, basketball and athletics. Other popular sports are floorball, bandy, motorsports, golf and swimming. Many Swedes enjoy outdoor activities like hiking, cycling and water sports. In football, major teams include IFK Göteborg and Malmö FF. Famous Swedish footballers include Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Popular ice hockey teams are Tre Krono, Jur Gordons IF and Feriestad BK. Top Swedish ice hockey players include Mats Sundin and Peter Forsberg. Sweden has performed very well at the Olympics, especially in sports like football, wrestling and swimming. At the World Championships, Sweden has medalled often in sports like athletics, skiing and ice hockey. Most Swedes lead active lifestyles. The government promotes sports and fitness initiatives nationwide. Sweden has high-quality sports facilities from local parks to large arenas. Youth sports programs develop athletic talent from a young age. If you enjoyed this video on Sweden, you'll love this next one.